In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up your Epson Workforce 2850 all in one printer with the MacBook. So, we are going to connect this printer with the Wi Fi network and then we will add drivers in the MacBook for wireless printing and scanning. Go to the printer control panel, scroll ahead and click on the setting icon. General setup network settings Wi-Fi setup Wi-Fi recommended change settings Wi-Fi setup wizard select your Wi-Fi network enter its password and press OK you can use the keypad to enter the password printer is connected to the Wi-Fi network go to the home screen go to your MacBook and open the web browser type in workforce 2850 driver select Epson website with your printer model it will display your printer wait for the download window to appear we can see your operating system select drivers and utility combo package installer click download open file double click on the installer open that's our download window agree with the terms and conditions continue agree you can select which things you want to install click install printer setup is complete click on the start select your connection wireless connection if you are using a USB you can use that and click continue select the option printer is already on my wireless network and continue start network setup you can also print a test page so click on the print paper output ray is here let's see the print quality so print is clear and if you want you can just do the alignment to increase the print quality go to your macbook continue if you want to add fax you can do now or continue you can do the fax setup later if you want you can register your product now or you can do it later as well click continue continue select your printer and click next you can register your printer so click next Printer setup is complete. Click close. You can close all windows. You can start using this printer for printing and scanning. So Epson Scan 2 is the actual app you want to use for the scanning. You can directly go to this app. Select your printer on the top. Check everything is OK. So let's place a, let's place a page for the scanning. I'm just going to scan a page. You can use the top. ADF tray or the scanner bed and then click on the scan icon scan has arrived if you want you can just save it or you can share it that is the complete setup of this printer using a macbook thanks for watching